Welcome back. The American flag flew high at Glacier National Park on Friday as U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services hosted a naturalization ceremony in the Apgar Amphitheater. MTN's Nicole Miller reports. Ten new U.S. citizens from across the world took the oath of allegiance and became naturalized citizens Friday at a ceremony in Glacier National Park. Deputy Superintendent of Glacier National Park, Eric Smith. I think this is a, uh, a very unique place for you to become citizens. It's really an honor to be part of the process and for that process to take place here instead of in a courtroom. Uh, it, it is a very solemn and, and formal process. You are now citizens of the United States of America. And for these past 230 years from today, the United States of America has served as a beacon of freedom and hope for the rest of the world. I'm confident that with the addition of the energy, industriousness, and hope, of new citizens like you, that the United States of America will continue to serve as that beacon of freedom and a hope for generations to come. Ellen Hibbs. Among those welcomed was Aline Hibbs from Sweden. I thought it was the most beautiful thing ever. I had no clue, I'd never been to one, and I thought it was absolutely stunning and so good. Who will forever cherish the day? <sighs> and I feel really welcome. High school students from Big Fork and Whitefish studying government got to leave class to watch the ceremony. Nadia Narji says it's a day she too will never forget. I know that a lot of Americans my age take their citizenship for granted or they just don't really know the importance of it. And coming here today and seeing people who have worked for it is really cool and it's a great experience. To the summit of the mountain. Reporting in Glacier National Park, Nicole Miller, MTN News. This was the second naturalization ceremony the park has hosted.